Do you own a new X MG300 and you're not sure how to update the firmware? Well, stay tuned because the next few minutes, I'm going to show you how to do it. Well, hey there, it's Scott at the Pedal Guy. How you doing? Well, we're all about pedal demos, pedal knowledge, and pedal sales. I love pedals, and so do you. In this video, I'm going to show you how to update the firmware on the Nuex MG300. Nuex does this from time to time. They'll release new firmwares. It's very easy to update. I've received a lot of questions on how to do it, so I felt compelled to do a video to take you through the steps. And the, thankfully, it's quite easy to do, and it only takes a couple of minutes. So this should be a fairly short video. Let's get to it. All right, so first things first, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and download the updater from the new X website. Once you've done that, uh, place it on the desktop so that you can find it easily, along with the file, that's the actual bin file, that's the one that's the updater for the MG300. Um, and once you launch the device updater, you'll see that it says no device found, and that's because we haven't put the MG300 into firmware update mode yet. In order to do that, it's very simple. You unplug the device, you hold down the loop and the drum foot switch simultaneously while plugging the device back in. And you can now see that it is in firmware update mode. Additionally, if you look at the device updater, you can now see it says device connected. At this point, and you can also press that refresh button if for some reason it doesn't pop up, but it should pop up the first time. Now, uh, what you wanna do next is go to select file and you wanna select that firmware updater. And once you've done that, it's ready to go. So at this point, all we have to do is simply Press the start update full, uh, button there and you can see that it's going to start updating on the app and you can also see here um, that it, a little green bar is starting to go from left to right across the screen, screen meaning that it is being updated as you can see in real time. This only takes a couple of minutes to do and once it's done that's all you have to do at that point. So once it's done you can then uh, use the quick tone editor. Um, uh, and uh, you should be good to go. So as you can see, it's about halfway done now. It's gonna be ready in just a second. So let's just give it one more minute here. And uh, once it's done, we'll get a, a message saying that the device has been updated and you can now quit the program. So there it is. Uh, it's now been completed here, just waiting for the message. So uh, give it one second here. Okay, there we go, device. Uh, successfully updated, you can now close the software. So we can close the software. We can now, un and you can see that it also says succeed there on the screen. We can now unplug and then replug in the device and we are now updated with the latest firmware. And that's all there is to it. Well, that's how you update the firmware on the new X MG300. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you have any further questions, just use the comments section and let me know. Have a good one. Well, thanks for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any further questions, be sure to visit us at thepedalguide.com. But in the meantime, follow us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and also be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for weekly videos and tutorials. Thanks for stopping by here at thepedalguide.com, where I love pedals and so do you.